This is our base. It's a safe zone. We store equipment here. With complete control of the sewer system, the tunnels enable us to bypass many of the Soviet roadblocks. All of our maps will indicate the location of the sewer access points. Let us go over to the table and take a look at the map. Secure the police station and liberate our leader, Isabella. Raise your flag to signal her release. The police officers will assist you, but they need your help taking out the snipers on the nearby gas station. The post office is a Soviet stronghold. It is used as a supply depot to support troops advancing into the city. Your brother is being held somewhere inside. Raise your flag on the roof to signal our victory. To get near the police station, you'll have to destroy a sniper's nest on the gas station. Please help! We're pinned down here! Hey, listen, buddy. Grab some explosives and get back to the sewers. Go to the gas station. That's where you'll need to blow the fuel tank. Just go through the sewer you came from. Yo, man. I gotta talk to you. Check that. You found some C4. All you gotta do now is blow the gas station. No way, pal. No one gets by until Isabella is free. Thanks, friend. Nice to get rid of the snipers. Listen, if you're going to infiltrate the police station, I recommend you use the subway tunnel. Enter the police station through the parking garage, but stay low or the soldiers will spot you.
going anywhere before our own colors are flying from the flagpole. Follow me, Chris. I'll take you to the safe house. Isabella! You're back! Yes, and I owe it all to this man. Hey, you must be Chris. Come on in! Mm. 
This is only a temporary base. We're using it as a staging place for this mission. Let's plan our next move. Like it or not, you have a new profession now. Freedom fighter. Nice work. Here we have an overview of the enemy compound. You can see them unloading equipment. They're using this post office as a temporary command center, and planning further advances into the city from here. It would really set them back if we recaptured this area. You won't be alone. Ever since you proved yourself by rescuing me, people are starting to believe in you. I'll let you lead two of my best men into action. Come on, follow me! Roger that, let's roll. We're rolling, let's move! You got it, they'll never know what hit As long hit as they're recruited, these guys will follow you wherever you go. Just like bodyguards. Now go fight! Good luck. Remember, you are the leader. You can issue your men commands. Order them to attack that small patrol up ahead. Attack! Good. Your men will fight every enemy in the direction you're pointing them. Find that shooter! Great. You're a true leader. No, oh, sometimes it's important to know when to fall back. Remember to check the map once in a while. Get them!
this is Tatiana Kempinski at SAFN Studios in New York. In today's headlines, a downtown precinct was attacked by rebels earlier today. The attackers freed several rebel detainees. There are reports of many casualties. Several witnesses confirmed that the raid was carried out by a small group of armed rebels, headed by an individual who authorities believe to be the new leader of the resistance. Isabella Angeline, seen in these pictures, is an important member of the underground resistance movement, and the operation looked like a carefully planned and executed rescue attempt. The group was led by a shadowy figure as yet unidentified, but believed to be a male Caucasian in his early 30s. Earlier today, I interviewed our leader, General Tatarin, on the situation. This sort of action against the Soviet Liberation Army will not be tolerated. And such attacks only increase tension here. However, I assure you that this was an isolated event and we have restored peace and stability. That was General Tatarin earlier today. On the phone now from Governor's Island is Comrade Colonel Boba, head of KGB. Comrade Kempinski, these people are not rebels from proletariat. This freedom phantom is vigilante, a terrorist. But they are few and will be executed when caught. After a trial, of course. And on this reassuring note, let's look at the forecast. What's in store for us on weather front tomorrow, comrade Ilyana? <laughs> 